I went to see my doctor the other day. I had to have a follow-up visit. I had a health issue that came up uh, last or earlier this year, back in the spring. And I had this follow-up visit with my doctor and had some blood work done. And seems like I've not been taking care of myself. The blood work didn't come back very good. The reality is I hadn't been exercising and hadn't been eating the way I should. And, and it was reflected in, in my blood work. And it made me think of what Paul says to Timothy and Titus. Four times in those letters to Timothy and Titus, Paul uses the phrase sound doctrine. And especially in 1 Timothy chapter 4, Paul has given Timothy instruction on what he should be teaching and preaching to the congregation there in Ephesus. And he tells him that if you will do these things, you will be a good minister and you will be constantly nourished on the words of faith and of sound doctrine. Now the word sound there in the Greek can also be translated healthy. He said, if you will teach these things, you will be nourished in the words of faith and, and on healthy teaching. We need to every once in a while, just like I did physically, I went and got some blood work done and now I realize I need to make some adjustments in how I take care of myself. Sometimes we need to stop and take a look at our spiritual health. Uh, we need to look at our spiritual blood work and, and see if whether or not we're taking care of ourselves the way we should spiritually. Are we being nourished on the words of truth, faith, and are, are, we, are we consuming things that are healthy for us? Are not only, phys, not only in the secular sense, you know, whether it be, you know, the television that we watch or the movies that we watch, but what about the teaching that we're listening to? The people that we trust, are they teaching us the truth? Are they nourishing us with healthy teaching? Maybe it's time for a checkup.